Happy hump day, Cougars. I'm here to help you with day eight of eighth grade math on the AMI. Um, as you notice in the assignment, we embedded a website that references transversals and parallel lines. So it's going to do a good job of, of you uh, being able to read and explore what these different things are. Um, looking at the assignment, making sure that we know um, what we're trying to accomplish is we are trying to make a statement about each of the eight angles and we need to use each vocabulary word at least once. So we need to use vertical angles, corresponding angles, alternate interior angles, alternate exterior angles, supplementary angles, and congruent. And so I'm going to take you to this website that you can reference yourself and just talk through a couple things. It's a really good website. It has all you should need for uh, getting this assignment done and even some extra things like it describes what an adjacent angle is or what two adjacent angles are, what complementary angles are. Supplementary angles, that's one of the terms you're gonna use. That is two angles that, whose sum adds up to 180. Typically, they're two angles that form a straight line. Uh, and then it goes down here and explains parallel lines um, that, are for, that are cut by a transversal and the angle pairs they form. Two things you want to think about is, are they on the inside of the two parallel lines, that's interior, or the outside, and those are exterior, and then are they on the same side of the um, transversal, or are they on opposite sides of the transversal? And then we have this other case of vertical pairs. I like to tell students vertical pairs are two angles that uh, sit across from each other in an X. They're formed by two intersecting lines. Uh, and so there's lots of examples of vertical pairs, supplementary pairs, and then as you move on down, uh, an example of alternate interior angles, alternate exterior angles, uh, and corresponding angles. And so I guess the only other thing we need to make sure that we understand is congruent angles. And there are lots of congruent angles when we're talking about parallel lines. Uh, so I'm just going to list them off real quick. Vertical angles are angles that are congruent. Corresponding angles are angles that are congruent. Alternate interior angles are congruent. And alternate exterior angles are congruent. So I think it's a really good website. I think it's going to be uh, a fairly easy day. Of course, contact your teacher if you have any trouble with it. And I hope you have a great day. Bye, Cougars.